All right, guys, welcome back to Shul Lights. Quick video, I got two Lewintop FW1 AA's. These are the new single emitter reflector 14500 lights. The reason I'm showing you is because people often ask, hey, you know, in this given light, how much more throwy is a luminous SST20 emitter than something like a Nietzsche 219C, which is what's on the right here, or even floodier would be a uh, Samsung LH351D. So these are the same light in every single way. The only difference is that emitter, and the emitters are the same size, both 35, 35, but the die is smaller on this side, and the dome and the die are bigger on this side. All right, I said die, I meant phosphor area, but I think you knew what I meant. Okay, let's come on out. Let me lock the exposure. There we go. Now let's take a look, okay? So we can keep them the same. Okay, there you go. That is the difference. So it's 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 considerable, guys. And and imagine that if this uh, rightmost light was LH351D, it'd be even larger. So uh, that ratio of emitter size to reflector size is what creates the beam profile. And as I said before, you can see that the phosphor area and the dome is much smaller on an SST20, even though they're both 35, so 3.5 millimeters on a side. All right, guys, see you in the next video.